We got people in Lansing that are not representing this area, and they're not representing the rest of the state. There are a lot of different cost savings we can do in Michigan, but it's not to take it out on the citizens and to go after the child, the children in school, the seniors, and the working people. There's no way we're going to build a better society in Michigan by taking the money out of education and not funding the future of this state. There's not going to be any way that we're going to make the state of Michigan a better place to live if we take all of the working people across the state and just put more restrictions on them as far as to be able to organize and we pay people less. If we keep paying people less in the state of Michigan, we're going to go down. We have to make sure that people that work for a living get paid for a living. And that's where they're going now. They do not want to have a middle class. We're going to be able to take the money from the middle class and the poor and put it in corporations. I don't stand for that. We have to do something about it. We got to change that. Thank you. We got to get people out in this election cycle. So I'm here to say today, I'm asking for your help. We need the volunteers to help us knock the doors. We need to have house parties where we can raise a couple of dollars to buy our literature and send out our lit through the mail. We got to have people out there helping us. That's the only way we're going to do this. We got to take back our state because we got people representing us that are not doing the job for us, the people. They're doing it for the corporations. So I'm asking for your help today. Before you leave, I want to say we have Curtis Adet here. I'd like Curtis to raise his hand. Curtis is our, going to be our full-time field organizer. He wants your name and address and email so we can start sending you some literature and we get you involved with the campaign. My campaign is up and running. I got Jack McDonald as the campaign manager out of Marquette and Kathy Connolly is also working with us full-time. Jack LaSalle. Jack, you're up and running there. I'm sorry. I was looking at Clarence. Jack LaSalle is our full-time guy doing that. We got a good organization put together. Starting on Monday, I'll be in Gogebic County. On the, on the border of Wisconsin, we're going to start knocking doors. We're going to knock doors all the way back to Marquette County. We're going to win the election. We're going to have people in the House of Representatives that's going to represent us, the people, not corporations. So I thank you all today for that. Thank you for your support coming out today.